Leone Market here in Belgrade. And we're going to our favorite nut place. We're done. Okay, we love all your stuff. Can I get a half a kilo of the ground walnuts again? That would be great. And the blueberries too. Those are fantastic. Th those. Oh, no, thank you. Just, he does. Okay. Super. Voila. Mmm, so. yum. They were really good. Thank you. And the ah, cherries no. were really good. No, no. Da. Okay. okay. Good. Da. Super. Good. Did you want cashews? Yeah, cashews. You had, you again. had cashews. Mm. You had really good cashews. Oh, right? they were so good. Yes, Go yeah. for uh, half kilo. Half kilo. Half kilo. Da. Yum. Okay, it's like little cookies. <laughs> honey, maybe I should get honey from you. Vishnya. Vala. The cherry? No, no. Cherry. Oh, yeah, those are so good. Huh? Mmm, Vala. Those are good. It's probably. It's good when they have the bees on them because it means it's organic. And these guys are so good. This stuff is amazing. It's delicious. Vala. Thank you. Vala. Vala. Oh my god. Wow, this is a beautiful market. This is really lovely. Really lovely. Ooh, old jewelry. Oh, look at these, Scott. Look at those beautiful babies. Thank you. I appreciate it. Thank you so much. We're at the Kalenic Market here in Belgrade and it has everything you could possibly need. Outside the so Kalenic. Really just a chicken store. And then there's an egg store and a bakery and a cheese shop. Fish shop. Fish shop. It's amazing. Oh, and flowers abound everywhere. This is the Kalinich Market in Beograd. Thank you.
see the food in these markets is really fresh these fruits and vegetables are not genetically modified to extend shipping and storage times so on the most perishable produce only buy what you're likely to eat in the next couple of days we absolutely love shopping in these markets they are so much fun and we know you'll enjoy them as well these markets are open seven days a week so it's easy to buy less and shop more often Overdone. Just bought some of those little pork chops right there.
Belgrade has over two dozen neighborhood markets, and shopping in any of them is a rewarding experience, made even better because of the kind sellers. Smiles, free samples, and genuine helpfulness seem to be the rule, not the exception. And language is never a barrier. Most sellers speak great English, and the few that don't are patient and kind. As you can see, these green markets have a lot more to offer than just produce. It's a great way to stretch your budget and it'll be some of the best food you've ever eaten. Hi everybody, we're back from Zeleny Venek Green Market in Belgrade and you can see how we did. This is everything I, we bought today. It's a lot of food. We kind of went crazy because we get excited when we go to this market. It's so fun to shop there. Okay, let's see what we got. We got four pretty look, good looking pork chops. We got a big old slab of pork belly. Woohoo! This was the big surprise. This is uh, essentially Serbian prosciutto, thin sliced. And um, they asked, how much do you want? And Shelly told them uh, like 8,000 dinars, which is about eight US dollars. Because I and thought we, it would be We nice. were thinking like what you get in Italian prosciutto, which is nothing, and we got this. Gigantic, tub. it's heavy. It's like two pounds of prosciutto for $8, <laughs> it's crazy. We got Gorgeous. these two, uh, they do something, the chicken breasts, they give you both breasts. Uh, that's just the breast, but there's two on each one. And those really? were about four dollars yeah. and eighty cents for the two, so it's about a buck twenty a breast. The chicken is so good here, and the chicken is really good. In Serbia, it is illegal to have GMO, genetically okay. modified foods, so these foods are amazing. So there's some parsley. There's a bunch of apples. So the apples. So there's like seven apples there. They were sixty cents. The onions are like a quarter for both of them. Carrots, two different types. It was eighty cents for the bundle. Uh, the corn is huge. Those were three for a dollar. We've seen it less than that, but these are giant. Really big. Uh, the cauliflower is like 80 cents. But this... This thing is a monster. This is the most beautiful <laughs> cabbage we've ever seen. We don't even know what to do with it. We it just be on the little shop of horrors. We just bought it because it it's looks so like pretty. yeah, it looks like it could eat <laughs> us. He's so it's pretty. so huge. There's my hand. He's giant. And look at this cabbage. Oh my god! And it's so it's beautiful. Just beautiful. Uh, that was a. It looks plastic. That was a dollar forty. Uh, and we just bought it for and the photo op. And it probably weighs three pounds. Okay. And here's oats. Yeah, they package oats here with rye and barley and, and wheat oats all these, together. Uh, those I packs make, were 45 cents each. I make granola with it to okay. go with this yogurt. Here's some uh, finished products, some packaged products. We got some yogurt, some heavy cream, some butter, some yogurt. Uh, all this stuff, uh, I don't have the exact prices on it. yogurt. Yeah, it's quite inexpensive compared to U.S. prices. Uh, like the heavy whipping cream, like two dollars. Yeah. The butters are like two bucks. The yogurts are way under a dollar, like forty cents. Um, this is Kymac. This is their own made kind of cross between uh, butter and cream and cheese. It's, it's a really, they call it Kymac. They call it a cheese, but oh my god, it's, it's creamy so like butter, but it's got a little bit of a granular texture to it. And oh my god, uh, is it delicious? Uh, you spread it on just anything. Yeah, raspberries were uh, two bucks for a nice big tub. But they're known for raspberries in Serbia. The raspberries are some of the best we've ever had. Amazing. Here is a uh, bottle of cherry juice. This is the like, Apple Man. It's like cherry concentrate. It's the Apple Man squeezes his own cherry juice, and oh my God, we're gonna have to dilute it. It's just like it's thick. It's like cherries on concentrate. You know, it's like cherry concentrate really, but it's fresh. Uh, we got talked into this. This is Rakia. <laughs> it's like homemade white lightning. It's Bathtub. like a buck a bottle or something. Uh, we bought it from the uh, Kymac lady, lady <laughs> who swore by it, and so we couldn't say no. And then we got some pastries, and so we got this one I think is a chocolate filled. And by the way, these are l pretty large pastries, you know, size of your hand. Um, this thing's got ham and cheese in it, and then these are just croissants. And the pastries were anywhere from like, you know, 60, 70 cents each. I think I paid about three bucks for all four so of them. So what's the total? So the total, 
we calculated it all and the total for our grocery shop today at the green market in Serbia, $57.85 American. <laughs> okay, so you can do, and the, and the product or the quality of the product is outstanding. So hope you like your trip to the market. See you later. We're out of here. We're Out of Here is all about finding a less stressful, more affordable lifestyle outside the U.S. If we can do it, you can too. Lots of videos to follow. Thanks for watching. Please subscribe.